Welcome back to our today's lesson. I believe that you have heard the last time. And if this is your first time to be here, my name is Paul Prince. And feel free to subscribe, share, and also hit the notification bell so that you may be alerted whenever I upload a new video. Don't waste too much time. Let's dive into today's lesson. Let's begin by reminding ourselves the names of these notes or keys because maybe some of us are so new to the piano so let's take just a quick revision because we handled this from the past lessons but let us go quickly about it the piano has the two black keys and three black keys repeated so when you see the two black keys this one is called C it is called C so we have C D E F G then from G there is no H so we go back to A then B okay so we have the C D E F G A and B then we go back to C so it repeats like that also there is these black keys so how do we name them okay we name these black keys from these white keys let's see for instance if this is C then this one here it will be a C sharp if this is D this will be a D sharp and if this is F then this will be F sharp and if this is G this is good it is G sharp and if this is A this is A sharp good so these black keys they have two names two names as in if you name them from left going to right you'll call them sharps but when you name from right going backward you'll have flats let's check for for example we are naming this uh, a sharp so when you use this key to name it this is B so it will be B flat meaning that the A sharp it can also be B flat A flat this one can be a G flat this one can be an E flat and this last one will be a good D flat that means that the D flat is also the C sharp the E flat is also uh, a D sharp the G flat it is also the, the F sharp the A flat is also the G sharp the B flat is also the A sharp okay today we are going to learn about the key G sharp G sharp is this key when you see these three keys three black keys the center one is G sharp it's G sharp or A flat so the scale of G sharp if we use the technique that we learned the last time uh, if you don't get it it is from one of my videos whereby we learned about tones and semitones the major scale so here we go from 1 to 2 there is a tone there is a tone semitone tone 
turn, turn, semi turn. So the scale is do re mi fa so la ti do do ti la so fa mi re do. That is the scale of G sharp or A flat. Now from there we can proceed to the second step whereby we shall learn about those chords that are making the scale. Now our chord number one is G sharp. So it is G sharp major because the major scale number one is a major number two it is a minor three is a minor number four is a, a major number five is a major number six is a minor number seven is a diminished chord and number eight is just the same as number one so here we go a chord number one is G sharp major or a flat major so here we find you hold you hold the, the G sharp G, G sharp note the C note and the D sharp note now this is G sharp chord G sharp major okay our chord number two here we come for the two Yes, so here we have uh, A sharp, C sharp, and F. That is A sharp minor and is our chord number two. A sharp minor. Our chord number three is C minor. So here we go. C minor. Our chord number four is is C sharp major. So we go. Whereby we hold the C sharp note, the F, and G sharp note. This is our chord number number four. Our chord number five is. D sharp major, so you hold the D sharp note, the G note, and H sharp note. This is our chord number five and is D sharp major. Our chord number six is F minor, so you come here, you hold the F minor, F note, the G sharp note, and C. That is our chord number six our chord number seven is G diminished G diminished so here you come the G note the A sharp note and the C sharp note this is G diminished and then number eight it is back to the octave So the scale goes like this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So Now, 
from here you can begin to play songs because those songs are made up of one two three four five six seven and eight so you you can practice any song you can just begin with this uh, progressions like one four one five uh, then you come to one four five four so that you can get the difference between the voice or, or the sound of chord one and chord two the sound between two and three the sound be between three and four you should have the difference in your ear that you may be able to interpret a song so here we involve ear hearing the sound and recognizing it as fast as possible so let's check out the progression maybe one for one for you here we go one four one five one four one five now from there we can go maybe you can go to one four five four one four five four so the progression one four five four so here we go one four five four one four five four and then you can just try something like one five four five so here we go one five four five one five four five now from there you can begin to add like um, something you can add the two three and six there is songs that involve those chords above all by Michael W. Smith start from the second part of the song so like like a rose mm -hmm. like a rose mm -hmm. trampled on the ground you took the fall and thought of me Like a rose and trampled on the ground, you took the fall and thought of me. Above all. Most of the times, I like using this song because it shows how the chords descend and ascend from six up to two you go from six five four three two and then three four five like that so it can help someone to uh, to get the difference between the six and five the five and four four and three three and two so once you achieve that skill it will help you a lot to interpret how songs are being played because without that you won't be able to play any song because you will be playing something else while the song goes in a different direction or progression so it is so much important to be able to differentiate between those chords thank you very much for watching if you have liked our video please like subscribe and share
thank you very much for watching if you have liked our video please like subscribe and share